Good afternoon, everybody. We are back. 44 degrees outside. Pretty sunny still. Looking good right now. We've got Chris first in the chat. What's going on, Chris? Straight luck? I don't know, man. John J. What's going on? John J. John J. John J. John J. Chris. Nick F. Good afternoon. John J. Thank you very much for the super chat. John J. says, for everybody not first... I want it that way. Tell me why, John Jay. I want it that way. John Jay, man, thank you very much for the super chat. Pudgy thought he was first again. I never wanna hear you say. Tell me why, John Jay. John Jay, man, thank you very much. Tim, Tim, we got old rounder Pudgy. Tim, Luna, Launcher, how you doing, man? Frank, Frank. Oh, Frank, haven't seen you in the morning er, the morning uh, live stream there. Glad to have you here. Tim, what's going on? Luna, Launcher, Pudgy, old rounder, Tim, Pudgy, Keith, and next level and Pudgy. What's going on? Tim didn't get to hear Pika's sticker. She sent him this morning. <laughs> There, he got to hear it right there. Tim, man, you got to come to the morning live streams. Dude, Pika sent you a king turkey. Oh, yes. Budgie, man. Thanks for the reminder. And the help for Tim right there. We've got AMC sitting in the top left-hand side of the screen right now. It is at $3.96. Shiba Inu coin sitting at eight fifty five right now. Not moving too much this afternoon, but still up 2.15% of the day. GameStop showing some volatility in after-hours trading, going from $16.49 down to $16 per share. Uh, Bitcoin sitting at $16,853 per coin right now, up 0.04% of the day, not moving very much at all. NASDAQ uh, closing the day at 10,305.24 points, not too bad there, but a loss of 1.47%. Uh, Bureau Therapeutics 2.04, oh my gosh, dude, down 13% on the day. Bureau Therapeutics is getting rocked, man. Bureau Therapeutics over the last four days, going from like $4 per share down to $2 per share, losing 50% in four days. Bureau is getting rocked very hard. Ethereum sitting at $1,250 per coin. Shiba Inu coin, $854. Dogecoin, 7.2 cents. Sorry. Bitcoin, 16853 Sundial, $212. Mullen Auto, $41.80 cent close. Very nice on Mullen Auto there. CEI. Dollar eighty CEI getting hit by five percent today. Spy closing to three seventy nine fifty. BBIG forty nine point sixty nine cents. Highcraft Mining fifty seven cents. Netflix three oh nine seventy. Terra Luna Classic fifteen four. QQQ two sixty one fifty eight. And Ape dollar thirty five today. Ape basically barcoding into the afternoon here, not doing too much at all. Perfect example of what a barcode looks like, guys. That is a legitimate barcode right there, and that is exactly what Ape was doing after, I would say, oh, geez, what time frame here? Uh, 2 o'clock, 2.40 basically out last hour and 15 minutes barcoding barcoding basically all day but at least it was moving around a little bit into the after after hours trading there didn't move at all we will watch bitcoin into the afternoon or after hours trading right now we'll see what goes on there patrick thank you very much for the super chat pat says a little authorized hydration for chris being first So smooth and so fresh. Thank you very much, Pat. Clear up, pop in when I can. The man frowns on me enjoying my time at work. I'm telling you, dude, the man. I, I Listen, if you could enjoy your time at work, don't you think that you would be slightly more productive? Tim, I think you would be, but I, I guess the man doesn't want productivity. The man wants control. So, yeah, I, I guess that's just the way it's going to be, dude. How bad did Tonic fall back? I have no idea. Let's see. I have not looked at Tonic since the earlier stream. So, let's see where Tectonic is currently at. Yeah, it didn't fall back that bad, but it did fall back. So, if we go out to Chrome, we can see that Tectonic currently sitting at 1477, still up 60% on the day, but it was at 1700 earlier. So, the daily on Tectonic here, hitting that level of resistance, and then boom, dropping back down. Good news is, it does seem like it's on the rise again. Will it be able to sustain that rise? Nobody knows. But man, I'm telling you, this is exactly where we were looking at it earlier, saying that it could be running into a level of resistance. And it did. And, and fell back down decently, decently heavy since that 1700 down to 1300. 
and back up to 1477 at the moment. Good news is it seems to be on the rise. Anybody still in, still trading? What do you got going on with your tectonic? Let us know in the comments because a lot of people in here do have tectonic, guys. Hey, bro, fam. Gorilla Invictus, man. How you doing? Been really busy with family. I did make a move today. Glad I sold my Biora or earlier this week. I'm telling you, dude. I would uh, I would be glad. That, well, I'm glad I don't have mine anymore. Not glad that I took a loss on it, but yeah, I am glad I got out of it. And I actually did make a, a pretty small trade on the QQQ today. I bought puts for like 15 minutes and got out with Tim's favorite. Tim's favorite. It was like a dead-on 10% gain. So, Tim, you should be proud of me, man. It actually might have been slightly less than 10%. Uh, I put it on at 10. I put it a uh, take profit on at a 10% gain, falling back down at like 145 or something. And it may have triggered slightly lower than 10%, but it was supposed to be at a 10% gain. So, Tim, I did that one for you, man. I did that one for you, which actually was a good move because the the option would have expired worthless. So, it was a good move there. I had the 261s. Oh, uh, let's see. Pat. Boom, baby. Fist, fist bump to Pat. Fist bump to Chris. I like it. Work is overrated. Work is overrated, man. Hey, listen, I truly believe if you're going to be getting your job done, it shouldn't matter how you get it done, right? Uh, and, and that might just be my personality or my style or whatever, but if you're going to get it done, I don't care how you get it done. Uh, but a lot of people really do care how you get it done. They want you to get it done the way that they want you to get it done. It's very strange, man. It's very strange. Do you think we'll have enough to push uh, of a push to break the next Bitcoin resistance level? Luna Launcher. Personally, I do not. However, doesn't mean that I'm going to be right. It absolutely does not mean that I'm going to be right. Uh, next Bitcoin resistance level is kind of in the 17,000 range. And although we are doing pretty nice, okay, although we are looking pretty nice and rising over the last couple of days, the bottom end of resistance is, is right here around 17,000. The upper end of this resistance level is still in the, the lower 17s, like 17.1, 17.2 area. I personally don't think that we break out of that. If we do, it could be a very good sign. But with, with the overall economy still not looking, I guess, beautiful and, and like it's growing, with inflation rates still on the rise, a slower rise, but still on the rise, and yes, they're still on the rise. They're not accelerating, but they are still increased. And then interest rates are, are also increasing. It's just a recipe for declines, okay? So I believe that you know the market could begin to go up before all of those things get remedied, but I think we still got some further downside, man, before we end up curling back up and finally hitting a bottom. Good news is the bottom, following these bear market cycles in cryptocurrency, the bottom should be in sometime this month if the previous cycles are repeating themselves. So if you believe that the previous cycles are going to repeat themselves, the bottom is going to be in in Bitcoin this month. Is that going to be the case? I absolutely do not know. The patterns are not guaranteed to repeat themselves, but if they do, that's what you're looking at. Uh, going to buy and hold Tectonic, it's taking 1 billion coin increments, Pat, man. That, listen, it, Tectonic is still cheap, though. Even though it ran up today 60% and, and 80 or 90% at one point, but it, even though it's up 60% right now, it's still cheap overall. If you look at a 10, 15, 20 million dollar market cap coin, Tectonic may not be one that busts out to a billion dollar market cap during the next bull market. And, and it may not be one of these amazing coins that, that everybody needs to have during the next bull market. But if it is, okay, you're looking at five to, to 10x gains just to get to a $100 million market cap. And from there to a billion dollar market cap, which is nice, but it's not phenomenal, is still another 10x gain. So you were looking at 50 to 100x gains to get to a billion dollar market cap. Beyond that, if it goes to a 20 billion, 30 billion dollar market cap, you're looking at two, 300x gains in, uh, no, 1,000x gains, right? Yeah, if you go from 10 million 
to 10 billion. 10 million, 100 million, 1 billion. Yeah, 10, 10, 10. You're, you're looking at 1,000x gains, dude. It, it could absolutely be ridiculous the amount of potential that you see in, in a coin as small as Tectonic. Is it guaranteed to do it? Absolutely not. Is it riskier because it's a lower market cap? Absolutely. So invest accordingly. Bone and bone or bashing time. Yeah, bone or bashing time. Well, I'll go with bone. I'll go with bone. Instead of or bashing time, I'll go with bone. Hit the like button. I like it. Test it. Do it, man. Hit that like button like test. King Mamba, what's happening, man? How you doing? Uh, part to one. Exited IRM, Ed, O, P, S, E, C, S, C, M, and Glad. Use that money to buy more Fort. Then exited Mall at 44. Woo hoo hoo! Added more Fort. Bring the average down to 1244. Finally. 1244, you can actually be in the green today. Who's in the 12s, right? Yeah, 1201. Down a little bit, but very nice. Bringing that. Oh, man. Very nice, bringing that average down to, to $12.44. Major level of support at that $10 to $11 area right there. Of course, it absolutely could be broken. This is a weekly chart, right? It's a very strong level of support there. Uh, bouncing off of it here back in 2021, again in 2021, again in 2022, again in 2022, and again here at the end, very end of 2022, bouncing off this like $10, $11 level of support there. So a Ford kind of consolidating into that area, but very nice, man. Question is, is it a long-term hold or are you going to be uh, you're going to be holding Ford and getting rid of it when it hits this resistance around 15, 16 bucks. That we want to know. Ah, oh, man. Why was it big clay? It was supposed to be big Ford. What is happening right there? Darn it. All right, let's go back to that. We are looking good. Part two. With over 100 shares sold, it covered calls for next Friday at $13 strike, earning $8.52. So it begins. And so it begins. Very nice, Frank. Frank sitting on 100 shares of Ford, selling those covered calls, making $8.52. Dude, getting that gen generating that weekly income. Frank can grab himself, uh, I mean, at those levels, Frank can grab himself an extra share of Ford every two weeks for basically free. Because if he was just sitting on it, he would not be able to generate that type of income. So Frank, loving it, man. Glad to see that right there. Absolutely right, Clay. Cheap enough to buy, hold, and stake half each billion plus purchase. Half each billion. Uh, stake half each billion and plus the purchase. There you go, Pat. I'm telling you, dude. It is. I still view Tectonic as a very risky play because it's got such a small market cap, right? I don't know if it's going to survive the bear market. And, and I don't know if I'm biased because so many people in here like Tectonic and so many people in here talk about it. But if if this sample of people is anything indicative of the overall market, Tectonic is going to be doing just fine, dude, because it seems like everybody is, is into Tectonic or at least questioning Tectonic or at least knows about Tectonic. And the fact that they know about it means that it could absolutely rally during the next bull market. And that's what causes the gains. That is what causes the gains. Guys, I think I'm going to do a video on Bonk later, okay? Has anybody seen Bonk trending like crazy today on Twitter? Over the last few days, 30x gains. Look at this. Let's go back out here to... Coin market cap. You guys got to see this. Nope, 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 nope. Click on this one. Uh, let's see here. Bonk. Right there. Bonk, man. 22% gains right now. Zero, 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 three. Well, 29999. But nonetheless, look at this all time graph. Just goes back to the end of 2022. Right? It's been on for about a week. One, two, three, four, five, six zeros. Currently sitting on one, two, three, four, five zeros and a three. Six zeros and a one, five zeros and a three. 30x gain over the last week. Today's volume, $118 million traded in bonk today. It is currently up 20% on the day, repping a $165 million market cap in a week's existence. 
I don't know how it has so many people buying it with $118 million flowing in over the last 24 hours. But nonetheless, this, this coin is trending on Twitter right now with over 130,000 tweets. Uh, it's on the Solana network, which the Solana network has been doing nice to recover over the last couple of days. But absolutely crazy, man, that you've got coins like this the, that are bringing in so much attention and so much money during this bear market. This, to me, is should be happening in a bull market. Okay, And this may be a good indicator that confidence might be coming back. It's either confidence or desperation. Might be coming back into the cryptocurrency space with gains like this and, and putting 120 or 100 and basically 60, 70 million dollar market caps on some coin that's been out for a week. So yeah, put that on your radars too, guys. If you uh, if you haven't seen Bonk yet, definitely put that on your radar. Ford is super long term hold, 100 shares, also nets you $15 every quarter for dividend. Boom, baby, $15. Not a ton every quarter, guys. You're sitting on uh, $60 a year annual dividend, but $60 a year if you reinvest that. If you've got uh, another $15 every two weeks coming in in options premiums. Dude, think about that right there, though, Frank. Uh, let people digest that a little bit as is how much money you can actually make trading options. If you're making 15 bucks every couple weeks trading options, selling your covered calls, and the dividend, which is a decent dividend, and you're making your, your dividend, basically, instead of every quarter, you're getting that dividend every two weeks. Now you're starting to talk, man. Now you're starting to generate some income. And now things can definitely add in. So you can basically, man, increase your position by what? 25% every year if you hit every one of those trades, right? I mean, dude, that is not bad at all. That is one way to look at it, and I like it. Sam Demand is at peak Sam Demand levels in the Discord. Quit! Go to the crypto channel and read his comments. Let's see where we are at here. Sam Demand on Discord community crypto general. Yes, come back down here to this. Let's see. Yes, thank you, J Bones. Fortnite is good. I got a girlfriend. She said, no more play Fortnite because I got mad and broke the controller. It is okay. Say sorry and buy a new one for her dad. Oh my god, dude. He broke her dad's video game controller? How is you two? Hi, Moji. Yes, I like live stream. Claybro is good. Q3 guy. I sleep all day and alarm go for five at night and I go to job. I say yes. Slap in lat and stay up late all night. Uh, in work, and I get new job with Taco Bell. Very good. My boss is hot AF. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I get a big yardstick and slap on, but too, but it's good for me. And she say, no, Sam, not in front of customers. Uh, a game with her is like game no other. And can't tell girlfriend too. I say it's good for me, and we hug too. Thank you. Well, thank you for telling him that he should not be hugging his boss at Taco Bell, man. Oh, boy. <clears throat> oh, boy. Listen, I've never worked at Taco. I've never worked at a fast food restaurant. Dude, I, I don't know if anybody else out there has. I don't know if, like, hugging your manager at a fast food restaurant is, is commonplace or what the deal is. But, uh, yeah, even if his manager is hot AF, he probably should not be hugging his manager and breaking his current girlfriend's dad's controller. Dude, I mean, the kid's going to have to work like a week to, to buy a new PS5 controller. My gosh, dude. JB, man, you guys straighten this kid out. You guys straighten this kid out. Oh, boy. 
only concern with Donic is that a majority is held by the developers, I believe. Yeah, that would be a pretty big concern, Pudgy. Especially if they dump, dude. If they make a ton of money, like if it goes back up to a $100 million market cap and they decide to dump, that would be pretty dangerous. It's with Solana? I wouldn't touch it. Yeah, it is with Solana, man. What exchange is that on? Uh, I do not know where you can get. So I don't have Bonk, right? I, I do not know what DeFi or CeFi exchange people are trading Bonk on right now. But, uh... I'm sure you can pretty pretty easily find it out on Twitter if you wanted to go check out where you can buy Bonk. Because I did see, like, Bybit uh, in, like, three other places. They were posting pictures of coming soon to those centralized exchanges. But I don't know if they were just being hopeful and, you know, hoping that Bonk gets listed on those exchanges or if Bybit actually created that art, and it was. Bonk, Chinese IPOs. Get in early, make your money. Get out, man. Yeah, and, and look, look, I'm not going to trash it because same thing for Shiba Inu coin, right? If Bonk, for some reason, develops some ridiculous cult-like community, then Bonk can do very well. Um, you know, you can still make money. Even if the, these Bonk guys, even if they plan on ripping their, ripping their community off, people still made 30x their money. If they're, if they're willing to get out right now, I mean, think about it. In 10 minutes from now, Bonk could be back down to a $5 million value. But right now, it's up. Seemingly, is not a honeypot. So if you're able to sell, somebody made some money. Bitcoin, turn it back over right now. Bitcoin throwing some purple lines on the chart. Oh, boy. Am I the only one who almost had a stroke reading Sam the Man? Oh, no, dude. Makes me nervous, too. You can't be hugging your manager, guys. Uh, let's see. Claire reads him well. I'm telling you, man. There's, there's like a little part of me that feels like some Sam demand sometimes. He's doing better over time. Oh, he's doing better over time. He's not posting inappropriate links and is more respectful to the women in our channel. Straighten him out over time. JB, good deal, man. It One struggle at a time, right? Just got to make sure this dude doesn't lose his job. I don't know why he's not working at, uh, at Subway anymore, but... I, I will assure you, if he continues to hug his manager at Taco Bell and she does not want him to hug her, he will not be working at Taco Bell for very long. So, like, I mean, dude, I, I don't know. If he wants to work at Taco Bell, great. Like, he can get some, he can bring some chalupas home to his girlfriend or dad. I'm sure at a discount. I'm sure they got discounts. But you can't be hugging your manager, dude. Like, I know it's a struggle. If she's hot AF, you might want to, but don't do it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Keep your discount. Work at Taco Bell. Buy your dad a new controller and, and move on. And don't forget, every two weeks, Ford receives its regular investment allocation. Uh, I Very good, Frank. Frank is adding in, man. Frank is adding in. Frank, you going for 200 shares? You going for the next, uh, next level up on the cover calls there? XRP was number two blue chip from Bitcoin 2018, if memory serves correct. If XRP wins the lawsuit, how long before its same results at 334.10x Luna Launcher? Uh, let me put it this way, man. I don't know if it's going to go directly to that 334. Or honestly, it could go, you know, obviously it could go lower. But I think it has a chance of going even higher, okay? I don't know. I do look into XRP every once in a while, but I don't know the current outstanding coins versus the current outstanding coins that, that there were in 2018. Right? I, I know that it, XRP did very well. And then the SEC lawsuit came in. But I know that XRP is heavily centralized. So if there are many more coins outstanding, I don't know if it's going to reach that same level. Um, the good news is they have continued to grow their business every day since then. So it could lead to a higher overall market cap than where they were in 2018, which would be legitimate. But I don't know where that puts the price because I don't know how many more or less coins that are, that are outstanding now than there were back then. Admiral, what's up? Uh, let's see. No, I cannot say that because that sounds dangerous. I don't know what it is. When I was working for Kraft, my stock dividend came out to about $12 a quarter. It paid for my Sam's Club membership for a few years. Nice, man. Nice. There you go, Pat. Not a bad dividend, man. It's Taco Bell's HR rep, DD214. What is going on, Taco Bell's HR rep? Please say skinny baby. Admiral, skinny baby, I can say. Whatever the other one was, I don't know if I can say that. 
It's the ticket for bonk one. Pudgy, it should just be bonk, man. It's just, it's just bonk. Bonk. Bonk is bonk. But I really don't know where you can get it. Um. So, I don't know if you can buy it on these places or if it's just tracked on these places. But whatever radium is, this one, gate.io, bybit, and bitget seem to be places that um, are, are trading right now. I don't know if they're just tracking the price or or if they're actually making trades on Bonk right now. But this is gate.io. You can check out gate.io, bybit, and bitget if you wanted places that you could potentially get bonk at if you were interested in it uh but yeah guys nonetheless bonk it is up today but it's coming back down a little bit it was at 299 now sitting at 277 nine percent gain on the day it was a 30 percent gain on the day earlier today but still sitting on 165 million dollar market cap it's a big coin guys it's a big coin uh, let's see. Reinvest dividends, reinvest premium. Soon, you'll have 200 shares. Just saying. No, facts, man. You really will. You really will. I listen to you at work on a construction site, and people on the job always look inside eye at me. You're funny as that. Anthony, man. Good deal. Good deal. I like it. Tell those guys to subscribe to the channel as well, and they can have some fun, Anthony. Uh, skinny baby, skinny baby. I like it. Admiral, I can definitely say skinny baby. Dindy James, man. Missed you, fam. Where the heck have you been, Dindy James? Ah, uh, it's my birthday, please. Yeah, Admiral, skinny baby, I like it. Uh, let's see. Emoji! Give him something to listen to, Anthony. Give him something to listen to. It's <laughs> such an intense one, I'm telling you, man. It's an, like an explosive workout. Like you're sitting there cleaning jerking or something. That turkey is not easy to do. But it is a good one, Moji, man. Thank you very much for the super chat. Absolutely loving it. I wonder if it's on Voyager and FTX. I highly doubt that it is on Voyager and or FTX. If it is, you are not touching it right now. Then ten dollars if you say skinny baby, skinny baby, man, skinny baby. Tonic was ninety percent gain today. Forget bonk. No, for real. But but tonic was a ninety percent gain today. Yes, you are correct on that. But, dude, Bonk over the last week is 30x. It's, it was a 3,000% gain over the last week. So, Bonk definitely is moving up. People are talking about it a lot more than they are Bonk. And, and Bonk has $165 million. It's a huge market cap, man. But I'm using Bonk as kind of like a bull market indicator, right? I don't really care too much about Bonk at this point. Uh, you know, it could 30x again, and it would be right up there with Shiba Inu coin, which would be crazy, right? If you're sporting Shiba Inu coin valuations in like the first week of trading, if, if you 30x again. So I, I still think it's pretty high in price and, and it's definitely inflated at the moment. But people buying things like that, I mean, that is exactly what we saw back in 2021. Clifford Inu comes out, boom, runs up in value. Shibnobi, that Shinja, comes out. Boom! Runs up in value. All of these coins coming out, just immediately running up in value. It is a... It's just what happens in bull markets, dude. So that's why I'm kind of excited about it. Because people are buying this literally nobody coin like we're in a bull market right now. Let's see. I think I'll keep growing forward with 1,000 shares, then just enjoy the income or get other stocks to 1,000 shares. Frank, that's actually, man, that would not be a bad idea at all. Um, You know, that listen, that's a decent long-term portfolio, right? And I don't know if, if Ford is going to sustain the levels that it's at, if it's going to be able to maintain that $10 to $11 level of support, if it comes down below it and all of that good stuff. But... I don't see Ford going anywhere. You know what I mean? Like, Ford is going to be around. Admiral, pronunciation. Baby? Maybe? Baby, skinny baby, whatever it is. Uh, oh, it's Tonic done over the week. Tonic done over the week is doubled in price. Tonic over the last week has gone from 9 or 8,000, 800 points, whatever you're 80, 800, 8,000, depending on where you're looking at it, points all the way up to the 1,700 
point level. So it has doubled in price over the last week. Slightly lower than double right at this moment. But Tectonic, 100% gain, man. Nothing wrong with 100% gains ever. A clay from the recent drop in the market over the like the last eight months. Have you been hurt from it? And if not, what have you done to avoid it? No, so Dindy James. Yeah, man. Yeah. My portfolio has been hit, dude. It's like freaking playing Battleship with uh, with somebody who's really good at Battleship. <laughs> Just keep striking Battleships, man. Uh, emotionally hurt? No, I haven't been emotionally hurt because I, I maintain that long-term approach. I maintain that long-term mentality. But yes, dude, short-term, the value has dropped. And it was a very, very difficult 2022, man. It's going to be a very, very good 2023 we are here we're optimistic we are set for gains it's gonna be a good 2023 2022 well it's in the past man it's, 2022 was a very strong it's very strong tax write-off year very very strong losses and, and hard hits on the portfolio so we're good to go there what's up bro sorry it's late kids getting to bed kids zero dad one boom baby there you go rich winning on that one okay next person to ask him to say something is gonna get in the timeout oh you better not be bad to punch you, man oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> you've had way too much cherry at christmas haven't you love the sound effects luna actually I had way too much ham at turkey everywhere was ham on turkey rich hydration the hydration is needed the hydration is much needed after that turkey oh just feels good going all the way down rich man thank you very much what happened with the admiral i don't know where he went pudgy i'll time out them right after oh man double time out show is my brother please say hello to him show hello to you hopefully you're having a great day today Pika Power! Thank you very much for the Super Chat Pika. Loving that little blank Pika right there. Ooh, yes. Ooh, yes. I hope you're right, sir, because, wow, 2022 killed me bad. No, I'm t yeah, I, listen, I, I, got sh I got shot like everybody else, dude. 2022 was a... Brrr, like, it was a brutal year. There's no denying that. I'm not going to sit here and act in, like in front of any of you guys. Like, I'm some sort of king of the markets and can predict the future and anything and... You know, didn't suffer any losses. I suffered right alongside you guys. But 2023 is a new year, man. 2023, 2022 was, okay, we make it through this. We are, we've got our scars. We've got our battle wounds, but we are ready to go. 2023 is going to be freaking solid. It is, man. It is. 2023 is going to set us up so nice that it's going to be ridiculous. Uh, Pika Pika? Oh, yes. Pika, think of the sticker? Yes, Pika. Tim saw. I, I gave him a little taste of that King Turkey earlier. Yo quiero Taco Bell. Well, talk to Sam, man. Sam the man's got a discount to Taco Bell. And whatever, listen, I don't know what, what Taco Bell Sam works at. But the manager there. Manager there is like that fire sauce, man. Patrick! Thank you very much for the Super Chat Pet says. I second that, Rich. While we're at it. Ooh, yes. Authorized hydration. Feels so good. And then while we're at it, why don't you take a hot dog and dip it and then shove it? <clears throat> yes, and then peel that banana, you lick it, and you stick it. Thank you very much, Pat, for the super chat. It's a double whammy for Clay because bear market leads to less traffic on YouTube, leading to less revenue on YouTube, leading to losses in the stock stock market. It's, yeah, it's, I mean, it is tough. It is tough, dude. It's less everywhere. But, dude, you make it through that. If you make it through that, I truly believe when everything turns around, it's a double whammy to the upside right? When you've got traffic flowing in to wonder what's going on here on YouTube, when you've got gains rolling back into your portfolio and everything's rolling up over there, you know, it is. It's more ad views on YouTube. It's more more percentage increases in your portfolio. It's a double whammy to the upside again, which is what you got to focus on, right? It's just what you got to focus on. And uh, you got to roll with the punches, man. So sometimes you get knocked down, but every single time, you get back up, man. You always if you get knocked down fifty-five times, guess how many times you get back up? 
How many? Is it 55 or 56? I guess if you get 55, you get knocked down, up. It's on a, It's on the same one. So one, down, up. If you get knocked down 55 times, you get up 55 times. Just never get knocked down 56 times and only get up 55 times. That's right, right? I think I'm right. Unless you started on the ground and you got up for the first time. You get knocked down again. And you've technically gotten up twice at that point. You need to get up 56 times. Well, let's just say we started. We were standing and then we, we were knocked down. And then that's one and one. Two and two, three and three. Yeah, so you get knocked down 55 times. You get up 55 times. Uh, let's see. Can you use losses and stocks for taxes, even if you haven't sold? Asking for emoji. So, no, you do need to close out your losses. That's why people go tax loss harvesting towards the end of the year. Uh, you do have to close out of those positions. Um, now, there are other things. You, you have to close out of that position. You can technically open other positions to kind of like offset it. So it's not like you're out of the market or only in cash at that point. But yeah, if you want to write the loss off, you actually have to close out that loss, book the loss, and and move on from there. You you can't just uh, you can't swing that loss and, and leave it in. And then if you're trying to get into the exact same stock, you have to be out of that loss. You have to you have to book that loss. And you can't open that stock back up again for 31 days. Or you trigger the wash sale rule, which means that you basically washed out and you, you can't use that loss there. They always want the gains, guys. They always want you to pay the capital gains taxes, but they will not let you wash out a, a loss unless it's crypto. Crypto is different right now. Tim, man, thank you very much for the super chat. Tim says... I don't know about this forever and always. Pika, forever and always. La pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika 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 pika. Yes, Tim, always. That is one of the favorite ones forever. You gotta know when to hold them, and you gotta know when to fold them. Know when to go on every single. Time, John Jay, you're right, man. No worries about 2022. Got plenty of tears for the next decade. That is true, dude. That is true. If you survive 2022, guys, do you understand how bad 2023 would have to be to like make you feel something after 2022? Like, in the grand scheme of things, if you guys have been alive for the last three years, and you've made it through 2020. You've made it through 2022. I honestly don't know what they what what they could throw at us that would make us depressed. I I feel like we have made it through so stinking much. Well, you're invincible now. Should have harvested my 99% loss on Dior Therapeutics. Yeah, I actually got out before it was a 99% loss, man. But uh, it was it was a heavy loss nonetheless. Bjor Therapeutics is down, 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 down. Tax loss Harvard in 2021. Enough to write off for three years. Boom, transparent. Yeah, dude, if you could write off for a lifetime, I'd, I'd probably be okay at this point. Don't give up. Doesn't apply in casinos. Well, it never applies anywhere. Don't ever give up, guys. Don't ever give up. Casinos, though, you should walk away. Walk away as soon as you're on top. Because if you continue to play in casinos, the only guy that wins is the house. Old man advice. Learn how to fight so no one ever knocks you down. That's some good advice, Tim. Did you ever do that shirt or hat idea? Dindy. What was the shirt idea? I gave away a bunch of shirts, but I don't know. I have never done any hats. Dindy, I think you have to. I think if you have gains, you pay taxes. If you have a loss, you pay taxes. At under the current, man, yeah. A anytime you pay taxes, you always have to pay. Talking about capital gains taxes, anybody want to move to Puerto Rico for a zero percent tax? I would. Yes, I would. I think that is probably where we should start. The Clay Bro or the Bro Trailer Park is in Canada or in Canada. I read Canada and said it. Definitely not Canada. Their taxes are too high. Puerto Rico. Only 18 like Oh my gosh, man. Click the stinking like button. You guys are about to get spanked, man. What are you doing? Pandemic would... I don't even know if I could say that crap.
Why are you guys making me yell words like that? I don't even know. YouTube's probably going to be like, ah, oh, jeez. Would be a walk in the park to compare it to nuclear war. Okay, yes it would, potentially, roulette wheel. So we're going to have to see if that plays out. But uh, look at roulette wheel, just trying to bring things down, man. I don't know if you can say it or not, but I don't know if I can say it new. Uh, gosh, man, you just made me say so many things that I don't know if I can say. I'm going to max out the losses for 2022 along with uh, Bo oh, Boku charitable donations. So we'll see how much I end up owing. Yeah, dude, I, I, I'm I going to be good. Hopefully... I'm not, I'm not going to owe anything this year. We'll say that. If you find yourself in a fight, your tactics suck. Oh, your fair fight, your tactics suck. Pika power! Thank you very much for the super chat. Pika is amazing. Pika, Pika? Pika, Pika? Oh, yes. And firstly, taxation is stuff. Secondly, find a sweaty neck scratching accountant. Sweaty neck scratching account. I don't even know what that means, but I like it. I'm down for moving living in Puerto Rico. Can we all live at the same address at roommates? Yeah, we probably could. So it could be like a we could just go buy some Puerto Rican mansion and then post up in there, dude. I think that that would actually be a really good idea. Patrick! And then we actually, you know, we could come back in and travel back and forth too. The place would always be maintained. Patrick, man, thank you very much for the Super Chat Pat says, smash that like button raw like good Catholics. Do it, man. Lord, I apologize for what? What do we mean? Good Catholic. Catholics are good. Catholics are good people. Good Catholics. I don't see anything wrong with that, dude. Uh, if you fall, make sure you see stars, not mud. I think that's good. Crypto losses are just money. Thank you, everybody, for good. I thank everybody for good health. It is true, man. And money is just a number. Like, I've convinced myself that money is just a number, and that is it. You know why? You, you Really, you want to know why? One of the reasons you can convince yourself that money is just a number. Like, I've got a house. Obviously, I could have a bigger house. I could have a newer house. I could have uh, a house on the ocean. I could have all of those things. But I have a house that I really like, okay? Like all my neighbors. My neighbors are far enough away that I don't really have to worry about them. Uh... It, Actually, all of them, the neighbors are really good. You can run into a lot of Karens, right? You get a lot of people that would be very annoying. But my neighbors are very cool, um, like all my neighbors. Um, so I'm good uh, in that category, right? So more money, you could buy a bigger house, and you could buy yourself some more problems. But when you when you get to a point where you kind of got what you like and things like that, so unless I go out and buy some sick car or, you know, uh, start to travel the world and things... What do you buy with it? You just invest it, right? You just invest it and, and reinvest it and reinvest it. So it just, it really is a number, man. It just keeps going back. It doesn't materialize into anything other than that number on the screen going up and down and up and down. It is literally just some number on the screen. And uh, when you boil it down to that, man, you, you do lose a little bit of an emotional attachment to it, seeing it's just a number, dude. Uh, Simon yo, what's going on, Simon, man? Where you been? Ah, uh, let's see. With an ad for the... No oh, yes. I like it. Moji! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that feels good. Thank you very much, Moji. We're gonna hit you boys with an ad because, uh, 22 likes, you're gonna make me cry. I'm not even gonna ask you about it. Moji says, ad, I'm hitting you with an ad. 44 people in here, you make it very difficult not to hit you with an ad because, uh, let's just be honest with each other, there should be more than 43 people in here. Uh, let's see. Don't, yeah, don't have taxes. Screw taxes. I like it. That's a little nut and a bolt there you got there. I'll get my mail. I'll get my mail to PR at the Claybro Estate, but I may never visit. Transparent. You can have your, you can have your mail sent there. I'm fine with that. Ah, uh, buy Moan. Did he do that? I do actually do not own any Moan right now. Keith, dude, Keith is killing it in Mullen Auto. If Keith has not sold his Mullen yet, Keith is doing very well, man. Keith's average 23 cents, rising up to 45 cents today. Keith almost doubling his money in Mullen Auto, doing very well there. Come back down off the 45 cent highs, down to 41.80 at the close, and then 40.39 right now. But nonetheless, man, some of you guys that are, are taking your chances in Mullen Auto there are doing very well. And I hope it continues to do very well for you. And tomorrow is another massive game. 
Diddy214, what up, bro? Oh, yes. So, Diddy, I'm in Mon at 19 cents. Oh, yes, dude. Tim and Tim and Keith, dude, killing that Molinado trade. Diddy! You're number one! <laughs> You're number one! <laughs> Dindy, man, thank you very much for the super sticker. Loving it. Pika, did somebody hack your account? Pika is sending, like, these blank super chats every five minutes or so, and she's not talking. We got to know. Oh, that's from OG. Oh, gosh. Now she's talking. I'm like, somebody hacked Pika's account. She's literally in here sending blank super chats every five minutes. What is going on right now? Pika, Pika. Thank you very much for the Super Chat, Pika. Absolutely appreciate it. Unicorn. This show's blank for me. It's not, it's, it's not a unicorn, is it? Is it a unicorn? I don't even see it. Is it a unicorn? I don't know. She says unicorn, dude. She's getting a unicorn. I don't even care, man. Pika says it. Pika gets it. That is a uh, straight fact on that one. Blank here, blank here as well. Pika! <laughs> Thank you very much, Pika, for the potential super stick. She sent a unicorn. Right, 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 right. Pika sent it. There you go. Moji sent a real unicorn. I like it. Moji with the real unicorn. Oh, yes. Mo Ooh, look at that sideways horn. Get ourselves a. Oh, no, we need a real. Moji, I got you, man. Moji. Ah, oh, oh, yes. Moji. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. I promise. I promise, guys. I, I am. I'm okay. I promise I'm okay. Moji, man. Thank you. Blank for Dindy. Blank for Rich. Blank for Pudgy. Yeah, 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 Pika. It is blank. I'm right back at you, sister. I like it, Moji. A little unicorn battle right there, guys. I would love to move to Puerto Rico, but my ex is there, so... Dude, Puerto Rico is large, man. We, we, could, we could have a gate. We could have a gate, Pat, right around the mansion, around the... Com we'll call it a compound, dude. We'll get a gate around the compound, and uh, we'll have, like, a guard. We'll have a guard at the door, and then when your ex rolls up, uh, the guard is going to say, <laughs> Tim, man, thank you very much for the Super Jet. Loving it right now. And and then your ex is going to walk away because when the guard does that, she's going to be scared for her life. Got to hand it to Pika for saving 50 cents on the stickers, man. Pika. Economy 101. She's going to teach you how to save right there. Throwing the blanks and calling them unicorns. Hello, everybody. Razi. Za, za, za. Za, za, za. What's going on, Razi? Glad to have you in here, man. Let's go back out and see what. Ooh, very interesting, guys. The volatility in bonk is real. Bonk down to 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 26 at the moment, down 6.52% over the last 24 hours. But nonetheless, guys, still looking very strong on the the overall chart or the, the one-week chart, essentially. There's no real difference if you're looking at an overall chart and you're looking at a one-week chart there. 165, let's refresh this because I know that's down a little bit. $151 million market cap with $115 million traded over the last 24 hours. Wild amounts of money being traded in bonk today. I think it's insane, man. I think it's insane. I don't know about you guys, but I think, I think bonk's going crazy right now. I don't think that many people should be trading a new coin like that in a bear market. Click, check out AVCT. Ooh, I've not looked at this in a while. Simon, let's see what you got going on in AVCT, man. Hopefully, you're killing that trade. Up 5% today. All right, up 5%. We got to go back down to the daily chart here. Dude. I don't know where you got in, AVCT, but I think I remember you talking about it, like down in this area, dude. So if you got in down here and you're rolling up to a buck 36, not bad at all. If it breaks this little area, 
If it breaks this, because it broke this resistance, broke this resistance at a buck twenty. If it breaks this area right in here, dude, you could be rolling back up to two bucks. I mean, that's your next level of resistance is is two dollars per share. That would not be bad at all. But okay, look at the long term graph. All right, it's literally done nothing but go down since 2019. Uh, not a stock or not a company that I'm terribly interested in, but I know you guys like these these hot chances where it could roll, and and it's pretty close to hitting that two dollar level of resistance here. Yeah, man, I don't know. It is right at a level of resistance right now, hitting this area back in here. But if it breaks it, man, you guys could be rolling back up to two dollars, two dollars and twenty cents. AVCT doing $3 million per day. The volume today, $2 million. Not bad at all. Or 2 million shares, which is about $2, 3000000 million. Nonetheless, man, AVCT looking pretty good over the last couple weeks, Simon. Bro, who has a wrench and why am I always getting timed out? Last live stream, timed out for five minutes. Well, that the blue wrenches are right there, man. I, I know you can see that, but I have no idea. I did not see you get timed out the last time. Uh, let's see. Puerto Rico. Forget Puerto Rico. I have a feeling it'll be a cheap luxury place in the Bahamas. If you know, you know. Yeah, actually, there there will most likely be a nice penthouse in the Bahamas here pretty soon. Like style, pudgy. Oh, yes. You guys seen the price of a bacon cheeseburger. So I just ordered a cheeseburger with bacon on the side. It's what you got to do, man. It's what you got to do. You, you got to compare price. Listen, the crap is so expensive right now. You got to do whatever you can to save 50 cents here, 50 cents there. And if they're going to give you bacon on the side for cheaper than you're going to get a bacon cheeseburger, you got to do it, man. Hey, bro, fam, man. This storm has been pretty epic to watch. But, man, that wind is wicked. There's more storms going on. Emma, my goodness. Uh, no one is ignoring me, but I'm getting timed out by someone randomly. Very strange. Uh, I have not seen it happen, guys. Have you seen it happen? Yeah, I don't know who's try who's timing out rosin. Uh, In-N-Out Burger. Best burger around for the price. We don't have any In-N-Out Burgers around here. If we do, I've never seen one. Arazi, I just got here, but I haven't noticed anything. I also have not either. Uh, I should clarify, ex-fiance lives there. We parted on good terms, so I will let sleeping dogs lie. Pat. Good. No, that, that really is good, man. I mean, if, if you guys were on good terms or whatever, that, that is probably one of the best things that you could possibly do, man. Especially if it led to, to better lives for both of you. I like it, Pat. Now, we, should, we can let her in the gate, dude. We can let her in the gate if she needs to come in the gate. We don't have to keep her out of the gate. It'll be okay. Hey, you gotta listen. Save that money by Lil Dicky. I've not heard that one, but I do like Lil Dicky, man. He's got some funny songs. I like that guy. Uh, Smash Burger, baby. Also, have not seen a Smash Burger. Hey, Miss IKA, who stole your pee? Oh, Pika? What? Somebody stole a pee? What is happening right now? I see Pika Power. You see Ika Power? Or is this some sort of a joke that I don't even know? Uh, good, Pat. Enough said. Heck yeah. Maybe she was overhydrated. Very well could have been. Heck nah. What a burger is the best. <laughs> I don't know if Dees has said anything in this live stream, but I love it when people hear something that just causes them to have to type. He hears the in and out. Is that what it was? He hears the in and out is the best. And then Gorilla comes in and said in and out is tops. I like it. <laughs> D says, heck nah, man, what a burger's better. Oh my gosh. I love it when people just are forced to type something. When it's not about anything that we're talking about except burgers. Moji, you're doing good, man. Hoji, a hamburger with cheese and bacon on the side. Oh, man. A slice of bread with some beef, bacon, and cheese on the side. Now we're getting somewhere, guys. Now we're getting somewhere. I don't know what you mean, but I place SBF. Have you ever had a Mr. B no, Razi, so I do want to. I thought that they I, I thought that they had a Mr. Beast burger at uh at five guys around here, but no, they don't. So I gotta find out where it is. I was gonna get one a couple months ago, but then I never got one. Is it good? Yeah, no, five guys is good, but 
uh, I thought they, and I called five guys, and they were like, no, that's not, we don't have Mr. Beast Burger here. So I, I don't know where the heck Mr. Beast Burger is around here. But I heard it's good. I do need to try it. Five Guys is good, but, f dude, Five Guys, and then you, you order fries, too? I don't know. I, I don't know how you justify spending, like, 20 bucks for a burger and fries, man. It, 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 like, almost fast food, right? It's kind of ridiculous. That's a lot. Dude, 20 bucks, you could go out and you could buy, like, 10 pounds of beef, dude. Not 10 pounds anymore. You could get ground beef for, for 2 bucks a pound, but I don't think you're getting it for that anymore. 350 it's ground beef right now, like three fifty. Ground beef from Tim's even better. But what's ground beef in this store right now? Like three dollars and fifty cents a pound. Yeah, you can get like three pounds of beef. Dude, could you imagine a three pound burger? Patrick, thank you very much for the super chat. Patrick says, "Quick, give me D. Have some hydration before clay goes dry." Oh yes, Emma D. Hydration for you and me. It is so good, man. It is so good. Because when you're talking nice and loud, you're screaming into the microphone, and that hydration hits you. It hits just right, Pat. Thank you very much. We have ghost kitchens here. We can buy a Mr. Beast Burgers. Yeah, I think that's what it is here, Diddy. I think that's what it is here, but I don't know where I can buy a Mr. Beast Burger. I did call five guys, and it was not. Uh, it, I could not get a Mr. Beast Burger there. It is juicy. That's what she said. I love it. This dude's, that's what she said himself. That's what I do, man. That's what she said. Uh, Tim, you need to start at chicken farm. Eggs are eggs are bank right. Eggs really are ridiculously priced right now. Like, but dude, my mom's got three chickens. My mom's about to be a millionaire because she's got three chickens. It's ridiculous. Uh, anyone else ever had Culver's? I have not. It's too expensive for this tight Scotsman. I feel you, Rich. I feel you. Culver's fish is really good. Well. Shoot, man. Rozzy knows. Rozzy's had it, did he? Clay, I posted in the Discord supporters group. It was showing as Ika Power on my end. Very, very weird. I need to see what she's doing. That is very weird, Emma. Because it is certainly showing as Pika Power on my end. Is her name the only one that's messed up for you? Dude, so this stuff's bizarre, man. I I don't know. Hey, Emma, if you end up getting blocked or something, let us know in the Discord, because clearly something's wrong with either your account or Pika's account. Could be Pika's account, though, because Pika said she sent a unicorn, and I know she was lying to me. She sent a blank super sticker. So, yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. Good evening, Clay. Burhan, good evening to you. Glad to have you in here, man. You may need to use food delivery app to get a Mr. Beast Burger. Not sure. Old Rounder, very well possible. Uh, it, it is very well possible, man, because I, I really don't know. Pat, thank you. I was going crazy. Needed to hydrate. Heck yeah, MD. Except chicken farms have been getting lots of fire. Yeah, dude, nobody burned my mom's house down because she owns three chickens. Like, don't do that. It's crazy. Thanks for the update, Clay. Bye. You're welcome, Luna. Bye. Enjoy your day, man. Covers fast food that's cooked to order and is so delicious. Mr. Beast Burger is on DoorDash. If there's any near you, it'll be on there. All right, Rozzy, good deal. I will have to check that out sometime because we're, how would you rate it compared to Five Guys? Real quick, dude, because it's the end of the live stream here. How would you rate it compared to Five Guys? Because I do think that Five Guys is great. I think Five Guys is too expensive for a cheeseburger, but I do think that Five Guys tastes delicious. Moji, poultry is a really low profit margin. Ch chickens are disease and parasite ridden. I'm sticking with beef and pork. Tim knows his numbers, man. I like it, Tim. Uh, later, Botados. Uh, see you later, Transparent Trading Man. Good night, Clay. Bedtime for me. Man, Clay Burhan, you're the man, dude, making me hungry. And it's uh, Yeah, dude. 10 p.m. for you. It's 5 p.m. You guys are making me hungry as well. It is 5 o'clock, guys. I don't know if I'm going to open up on TikTok a little bit later or not. If you guys want to jump over there, I might be doing another battle. And if, if uh, Stephanie wants to, if not, I might just be opening up if I got some time tonight. But nonetheless, get your name in the chat. We'll do some shout-outs. And then we will be back tonight, 7 p.m., 8 p.m. Eastern Time with videos. Moji! Thank you very much for the super chat. Ooh, yes, we got a little hydration. You guys are last of the hydration, Moji. 
Ah, uh, hydration for the hardest diamonds that show every day here. Appreciate the bro fam. Dude, we love the bro fam. And I know for a fact, those that make it through this bear market, the 40 of you guys that show up every day, we are going to be wildly successful. It is going to be crazy. It's comparable to five guys because five guys is on another. Oh, gotcha. Five guys is on another level. Five guys is really good. I can show you how to cook a quality burger. Pudgy, I would you want to know how to cook, cook a quality burger, man. I love burgers. So uh, Pika was messing with her name. Now I'll have to see if anyone else changes randomly if I get blocked. Yes, you will, M&D. Please be careful. Guys, we'll do these shout-outs, and we will be back. Chris says, I will never get a Mr. Beast burger for the sake of not supporting Mr. Beast. Chris does not like Mr. Beast. Chris, man, please never feel that way about me, okay? Please not. If, I, if we get, like, a bro burger that comes out, please taste the bro burger, man. Just taste the bro burger. These Clay bro rules. These. Nuts rules, Dees, man. Thank you very much. I feel like I left a long enough pause in there that it, it's acceptable. Dees, thank you very much for the five-month member chat. Absolutely appreciate that, man. We'll do these shout-outs, guys. We'll be back later. Rich, Dindy, Emma, Anthony, Burhan, Old Rounder Bro, Mama Mella, 11, 11 Mr. Simon, Mama Mella. See you later. Dees, Burhan, Gorilla, Moji, Dees, Razi, Gregory, D, S. Rodriguez. I know you guys, Tectonic is pumping. Yes, Tectonic is doing very good today. Rodriguez, up above, it was up 90% earlier, 60% right now. D, Chris, man, be first in line for the broger, baby. Boom, we're going to have that bro. It's going to taste so good. Although, I don't know if I can call it a broger, dude. People are going to be calling that like a broger. It looks too close, and, and, and all, they don't need to eat that. Uh, D, man, see you later. We got DD214, Cryptoholic, did he do that? Peace out to you. We got Johnston Town. I don't know if Nick F, Emma D, or oh, Emma D is in here. I don't know if I shouted her out. Peak of power. Enjoy your evening. SD, man. Moji. Moji. Thank you very much for the... Moji. Thank you for Clay Bros, Peach. Oh, yeah. That's for D's right there. D's, hopefully. You can touch it, man. Moji said you could touch it. And did he do that? Johnson Town, Moji, Burhan, Moji. All of you guys, you know what time it is. You want to say it with me? Say it with me. Till the next time. Hope to each and every one of you have an awesome day. Thank you. We got Queen Pika, Emma D, and a little Ghost Queen for Danelle. Ooh, Danelle. Queen Pika, I present this crown to you. Queen Emma D, I present this crown to you. Danelle. I present this crown to you. Thank you very much. Tim for the super chat for crowning Queen Pika, Queen Emma, and Queen Danelle, man. Absolutely loving it. Shout out to you, Tim. D's, man. Enjoy your day, Burhan. Dindy, Dindy, Pudgy, Dindy. We've got Rodriguez, Burhan, Cryptoholic. We got Dindy, Rich, Dindy. All of you guys. Pat, man, if you're still in here, shout out to you. You know what time it is. You guys want to say it with me? Say it with me. Until the next time, hope to each and every one of you have an awesome day. La pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika, la pika 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 pika. Last time, you guys better do it with me. La pika pika, la pika pika, la pika 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 pika. La pika 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 peek. Moji, man. Thank you very much for the pika pika. If you guys didn't do that on the way out, do it on the way home today. Moji, man. Absolutely appreciate that super sticker. Pikachu better be in here. Pika pika, you still in here? You better be in here. Razi, Zazi, Zazi, man. See you later, Razi, Burhan, Pudgy, Razi, Moji, man. Thank you very much for the pika pika. D's, Dindy, 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 Burhan, Razi, Dindy, Dindy, D's, Rodriguez, Man, cryptoholic D's Burhan, Burhan, Dindy, Dindy, Razi, 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 all of you guys. You know what time it is. You want to say it with me? Say it with me. Till the next time. Hope to each and every one of you have an awesome day.
This dude is the latest dude ever. Ow. Mm. Mm, that's a five. Ow. Nope. Mm -mm. That's a Mr. Beast. Ow. Mm, nope. That's a bro burger, baby. Outdoor smile. Thank you very much for the super chat. Absolutely loving it, man. That is the most delicious burger I have ever partaken in in my entire life. Outdoor smile, man. Loving it. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, but Tim, it's time to go, man. <laughs> Tim, time to go, Tim. Enjoy your afternoon, man. See you later, Rozzy, Burhan, Pudgy, Outdoor Smile, Tim, Burhan, Kristen. You missed it, but here is the encore. Now we are leaving again, Kristen. Dindy, Rozzy, Moji, Kristen, Rozzy, Kristen, Pudgy, Kristen, Dindy, Dindy, Kristen, Dindy, Cryptoholic, Rozzy, Kristen, all of you guys. You know what time it is. You want to say it with me? Say it with me. Till the next time, hope to each and every one of you have an awesome day. You know what time it is? Time to get hard. <sighs> ah, like a diamond. Tim, dude, thank you very much for this super chat. You guys better all be hard like diamonds out there. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, 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 budgie, man. Thank you very much for the scary, scary super chat. Dindy, shout out to you. Oh, Moji says, a little banana action. I'll give you that banana action. Tilt the head back a little bit. You lick it, and you stick it. Moji, thank you very much for the super sticker, super banana. Oh, yes. Tim, man, shout out to you. Burhan, Pudgy, enjoy your days, man. Dindy, Kristen, Dindy, Rozzy, Moji, Burhan, Kristen, Mr. Sabanin, yo. We've got Rozzy, Dindy, Moji, Burhan, and Kristen. All of you guys, you know what time it is. You want to say it with me? Say it with me. Till the next time, hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day. <laughs> you you guys better you guys better refresh your feed. You're getting a little slow there. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> I can't even keep crying, man. Tim, dude, thank you very much for the super chat. Huh? 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 <laughs> thank you very much for the super chat as well yes guys absolutely loving it man tim appreciate you dude dindy thank you very much Razi, oh yes moji look at john jay oh john jay is gonna make me pass out john jay i got you dude you ready for this <laughs> John Jay, oh, thank you very much for the super chat, John Jay. That one is not easy to do, guys. I'm telling you, exhale like that, it gets a little crazy. John Jay, thank you very much for the super chat. Dindy James, man, see you later. D's, D oh, oh my gosh, I almost said it. D's, Diddy, Willie, Burhan, Burhan, Moji, Pudgy, Rozzy, Kristen, John Jay, we got Dindy, 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 Rozzy, Burhan, Kristen, Dindy, Pudgy, Rozzy, Moji, Rozzy, all of you guys. You know what time it is. You want to say it with me, say it with me. Till the next time, hope that each and every one of you have a peak of power. Peak of power for sure has been hacked. Pika, is that a, uh, is that a little Pika Pika? Is that, is that a little Pika Pika Pika? What are you doing out there? Pika for sure hacked on this one, guys. For sure. Tim says, are we leaving? Nope. Are we leaving, Tim? Nope. Are we leaving, Tim? 
Nope, we are not leaving. Yeah, she's just gonna make. I don't know. Is it a unicorn? Could be a unicorn. I don't know what she's gonna say. It is. Pika can have whatever she wants. Pika can have whatever she wants. Aw, Pika. <laughs> oh gosh, Pika and Tim, man. Thank you guys very much. Burhan, shout out to UDs. Mr. Simon, boom, baby. Pika, Tim, Rozzy, Kristen, Dindy, Old Rounder, Dindy Emoji, Dindy, Dindy, Burhan, Rozzy. All of you guys, you know what time it is. You want to say it with me? Say it with me. Till the next time, hope to each and every one of you. Have an awesome day.